And we are back with Business Radio X Pro Tips. Stone Payton, Lee Cantor here with you. And Lee, I got to tell you, I am really enjoying relating some of these stories. They're fond memories for me, and it's they serve as such great reminders of uh, the good that we're doing out there. Yeah, I, I think it's important for people. I know a lot of times when people are thinking about a service, they are so focused in on the money, the ROI, how much money is this going to generate, and they kind of lose sight of things that are really part of their core values, like legacy and impact. Have you? kind of run into anybody or have any stories when it comes to them articulating the importance of legacy and impact in their lives that a lot of times that's going to supersede, you know, the money part of this. It's the goodwill that you're doing to the community. So yes, I have a ton of those stories, but the most recent was this morning. I am part of a group called Young Professionals of Woodstock. My studio is in the city of Woodstock, which is a suburb of Atlanta, and it's in Cherokee County, so my studio is referred to as Cherokee Business Radio. One of my clients is a member of this group, Young Professionals of Woodstock, and this is not a traditional networky kind of group. I'm not a very networky guy. It's not my vibe, and I don't need to do that traditional networking because I had the benefit of the Business Radio X platform, but I really enjoy this group. The format for this thing, and this group is much more about building relationships, impacting the community. The format for this group is we have a question every week, and this morning's question was, when you pass away, how would you like to be remembered? And there were two or three people that went before this young lady. Her name is Sharon Klein. She's a client. She hosts the show Fearless Formula at Cherokee Business Radio on the Business Radio X network, and they had good responses, you know, and they talked about, you know, doing well with their kids so that so that some of their values would would live on. They talked about, you know, that they hoped that they had encouraged other people to to pay it forward and they were all great answers. When it got to Sharon, and incidentally the reason Sharon's a client, she's a voiceover artist and she does corporate work for Audible and for corporations. So she does everything from reading those novels to doing like corporate training audio tracks and and that kind of thing. When it got to Sharon, she said that when she passes, she hopes that she would be remembered as someone who had really put a dent in the universe, was the way that she put it, had a genuine impact on her community and specific individuals in the community. She wanted to leave that kind of legacy, and she said, and that is why I love so much hosting a show on the Business Radio X network because it gives me an opportunity that where I can let people in the community share their story, promote their work, and just authentically get the word out about what they're trying to do for their community, their profession. It's, it's just, um, it, when she said that, Lee, I got to tell you, man, I, I welled up. I could barely hold it together. I mean, I had, I had tears in my eyes and people could tell, I, I'm getting tears in my eyes telling you right now, because I mean, this was just a few hours ago, <laughs> but it just, it filled my heart. My chest swelled. I walked out of that room nine foot off of the air and it helped me realize and it, it made me feel so good that I'm doing it. What I'm doing has impacted Sharon, but it's like, there's like this multiplier effect because as a result, Sharon is able to do this for the people she brings into the studio. And I'm sure, I know that there is effect be, beyond that. And it just uh, feels so good. And it's another one of those things that, that I guess intellectually, I've known all along that we're doing that. And it's another one of those marvelous gifts that I think sometimes we take for, for granted. But um, man, it just, it really underscored for me the importance of legacy for most of us and the gift, the blessing, the vehicle we have here for intentionally leaving the kind of legacy that we choose to leave. 